You guys know I took this to Ray to paint it. He did a fantastic job. But when I was going to shows, I wanted my exhaust tip to really shine. And I put a tire shine on it. So I think that just mess up with the clear coat. Now, I don't want to spend money on it. So I'm gonna try to fix it myself. Ray has nothing to do with it. Wasn't his fault. He did an amazing job. If you guys ever need like exhaust tip, he is the king of it. But I, I'm investing money in other stuff now. I don't. I cannot put money on that. And I, if you are guys wondering, I always pay Ray. <laughs> nothing is for free. But I really recommend him for that kind of stuff and the paint should be here tomorrow but for you guys it's gonna be a couple of seconds but while you were waiting i took gary for a ride on my car his first time riding in a camped car so let's do this while you guys are waiting for actually i well actually while i'm waiting for the paint they should be here tomorrow you guys enjoy some uh, gary's reaction to my car uh I'll catch you guys in a couple seconds right so that's gary's uh first ride on the seat do i get out of here this yeah it'll be pressing all right <laughs> Welcome to the other day. I hope you guys enjoy this little drive with Gary. Uh, people normally ask if I let them drive my car. I mean, if I know you, I know you're responsible, we are in a safe place. I don't see why, you know what I'm saying? Like, uh, I remember when I was younger and I saw a dude with a car, they never offered me, hey, you wanna drive? So I don't wanna be like them, that's why I normally offer. Maybe I'm gonna, you know, give that person a, like a life change experience. Not that my car is like super cool or whatever, but maybe it's the only chance that that person has to drive a nice car. So I don't really mind. Of course, not everybody's gonna drive, but if I know the person, we are in a safe place and you, you guys got the drill. But anyway, so I masked everything up on the car. Uh, good to go, look. So the only reason why I'm not gonna try to polish and leave like this, it's because it's really hard to get to the cracks. I kind of went with knife and try to, to do. And here's the thing though, which paint I'm gonna use it. And I'm gonna take a gamble here, right? We're gonna use brake caliper paint. 
If you guys are following the channel for a little while, you know that uh, I, I use this many times. My truck, this car, when I did the right calipers, the C5, everything was this freaking thing and this works so well. My calipers looked like it was pow powder coat. So I went with black, as you can see. I'll give it a shot. If it's too bad, I'll send it down again and we'll call the day. If not, I just find out a little trick. So let's do it. did like two coats I still have a lot left I might end up using it because they recommend to use the entire small can it's a small can see but it's for calipers calipers are way bigger than this requires more but so far I like it looks fresh it's not messy and the way I why I like it you can push you can put the brush in any direction I don't know what is in this <laughs> in this <laughs> kind of thing that doesn't look like it was brushed. It looks like it was sprayed. Uh, and that's what makes this even better. I don't know. I will probably do one more coat just to be safe. <laughs> and should be it. I mean, not doing anything inside because it gets super dirty. <sighs> should be it. We should be good to go. <laughs> Well, that's it. That's the final coat. Of course, it's too wet. I'm gonna wait for dry. Once it dries, I'm gonna remove everything. Maybe it will be a better day because today it's kind of crappy day. And then we will take outside and look at it. If it looks like this, when it dries, I'm pretty happy. So let's see. People ask me how low my car is. <laughs> Just love it. We'll see what's gonna happen. It's super, uh, you can definitely clean. Uh, I like it. So I was saying it's too loud. I don't know. Every time I'm gonna edit it, uh, that the audio is not good. Looks like it was power coated, <laughs> to be honest. Like from when you close, I like it. When it's closed, <laughs> I mean, there there are some imperfections for sure, but not as bad. Just here, some dripping over here, but you can barely see. Let's see how that's gonna hold on the longer run. I also put a new uh, license plate frame. And should be it. So I had this idea and I don't know what I'm gonna do as far as exhaust to go once the white body goes in. Maybe I'll change the tips. That's why I was like, you know, I'll just take a risk. I recommend, I don't know, I do. Depends how peak you are. Not the best solution. There are other solutions out there, but definitely brake calipers are the good ones to go. This one's really easy to paint. Once you open the entire package, there's no way back. You cannot save that paint because it's gonna be so hard. And the next day, I, I already throw my out. And but so far, I'll keep you guys posted in the future to see how that holds. But so far, I like it. It's gloss black with the entire thing that I'm going with the car. But so far doing good i don't think i have anything left on this uh besides a couple touch-ups i have a couple shows to do uh I, <clears throat> this month 
we'll see how that goes keep your eyes out for more people i'm inviting people to show their car so we can talk about you know the car and uh everything about it right i'll see you guys next one thanks so much for watching never forget enjoy your life and work hard for it